To our community, it's somewhere more than just an art centre. It's a gathering space. It's where we have everyone from infants to seniors come in and use the facility. There's huge amounts of benefits, both economically and culturally, in what we're doing here. Um, economically, it brings a whole new um, tourism aspect into our, into our area. That's going to bring economic benefits to our hotels, our shopkeepers, our retail, and all the associated um, um, businesses that go in with the art centre as well. So that's enormous. Um, we've injected nearly $3 million into our local economy through steelworks, concrete works, carpentry works, even down to equipment hire, as well as um, creating 56 jobs for the period of the build. So that's been a really great outcome for a lot of our tradespeople that have been here as well. Culturally, you know, we'll have people coming from all parts of Victoria to see shows here. For me, the excitement is to see that first crowd in there, uh, listening to that first show, sitting in the balcony, looking down. The excitement's going to be fantastic. There's been a lot of people involved. They all have their special reasons and their, their special um, inputs that they've put in. Uh, I'd like to, of course, thank the state and federal government. Um, the support group or the reference group that's looking after the works. And, and of course, the biggest one is we've got to be able to thank the community. They all can see the end game and the big picture here. And in the end, we're going to have something that's going to be envious to a lot of the other communities around us. Coming forward is going to be the public open day, which coincides with the farmer's market here on the 17th of November. So the beauty of that is that you'll be able to go to our local market, help out the economy here, walk inside and see how we're going to move into the future with what's there. The um, art centre opens up to the community with the way that it's going to be set out. So um, the 17th of November, it's open house. You don't need an invitation. Anybody can come in, have a wander through and just see how sensational this uh, new centre is going to be.